and welcome my fellow YouTubers, subscribers, followers, friends, and other tarot readers. Today, I'm gonna do a Valentine's special love reading for you, Gemini, the card of lovers. So, let's talk about the spread. How, what is your energy in the relationship? Your partner's energy in the relationship? How strong is your relationship? And what can you do to strengthen the relationship? All right, so let's do this. Come on, Gemini, Gemini, Gemini. Give me the good stuff. Give me the good. Give me the good. Come on. Come on. We can do this. Give me the good. Come on. We can do this. We can do this. Come on. Almost got this. Almost got this. Almost. 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 Just a little bit more shuffle energy. One more shuffle. And let's do this. Your energy in the relationship? Your partner's energy in the relationship? Hmm, what is this? Oh, yeah. How solid is your relationship? What can you do to strengthen the relationship? Let's see what your energy is in the relationship. The tower looks like something crumbled between you, like some sort of... This is a card of Scorpio and Mars. Looks like something happened between you, like a breakup, but not dire breakup just like like those moose and mage couple you may not have heard of them but this is a couple that always breaks up but always gets back together in like two minutes flat they even set a world record but anyway what i'm trying to say is that it could be a major breakup or it could be a minor breakup it all depends on your partner's energy all right all right so are you ready for this your partner's energy let's see it Eight of Wands. A lot of news is coming in. It's a it's a very busy partner. So this kind of looks like a, a partner which a lot of information is coming for this partner. Like, like this partner is a messenger and it looks like you two are not coming back. This, this is not working out. But we can only know for sure when we know the strength of the relationship. Gemini's. Okay, so let's see your the strength of your relationship. Queen of Wands. It looks like one is dominating over the other. It doesn't look like an evil, equal relationship. It doesn't look like that at all. I don't know which it is. It could be you. It could be another. It could be your partner. But whatever it is, this is not the. Key. This is not a good thing. Okay. Okay. And finally, let's see what can you do to strengthen the relationship. End the burden. What is meant to happen will happen. So this, this looks like this relationship won't work out. Don't be sad. There's a hell lot of fish in the sea. So many, there is very little water and too many fishes. This Ten of Swords is a card of ending. End all, the, all these conflicts, all these burdens between you guys. And start, and start scratch, start from scratch, start fresh, Gemini's, start fresh. So I hope you have a great time with your Valentine. Tell, tell them what you need to tell them. V for Vienna, blah, 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 peace, peace, peace.